Hi everyone, this is Joyce, director at the Slotesburg Food Pantry. This month I thought I would change up our update to be a video instead of a written correspondence. Reason being, we're doing our renovation at All Souls Community Church and I wanted to give everyone a little bit of a view of what's going on. So I'm going to take you on a little tour. As many of you know, this is Oliver Street, which is where our clients drive up for our distributions now. They come up the street and they stop here and in the driveway we have our refrigerated truck, tents and tables where we serve them from. The renovation work is focused on the inside, so I'm going to take you there. This door will actually become a double door with a very sturdy cement ramp to help us bring in our food. Last month we purchased 15,000 pounds, just non-perishable, plus another 15,000 of meat, cheese, milk, bread, eggs. This section right here is what will be the choice pantry. So clients will enter through the door and there will be racks of food for them to choose from. Center aisle will probably have all of our fresh produce and we will have our milk and eggs and all the goodies that we can get. So this is very exciting because clients will be able to choose the items that they need and they'll be able to come back inside with us. The second portion of the renovation is setting up our workspace and walk-in fridge and freezer. That will be over here. And this will be where our volunteers will accept donations as well as load and store our cold items. I'm just gonna give you an view of the fellowship hall. Now this is a beautiful large room that we use now for our packing, which we will still be able to utilize when our clients come through. They will enter and be greeted and wait to enter the pantry from here. We will have adequate room to do social distancing if we need to and maybe offer some additional information and services to our clients. So this is the fellowship hall. I just wanted to do a quick view of our rendering photos so that everyone can just see this is our kitchen space and over here is the pantry. So in order to make this a reality, we are doing um, extensive fundraising. So my ask of all of you is to tell your friends and family, companies that you work for about us, um, about the work that we're doing, and ask for donations. <laughs> um, we have a $200,000 goal and we've hit 60000 so far. And th thank you for everyone who's, who's donated. Um, quick update for September, if I can shift gears. We're open on the 8th for Fresh Express. We will be doing our monthly delivery on the 14th. The 20th will be our box packing, where we'll pack 350 boxes for the 22nd when we do our traditional opening. Um, last month, just so that you know, we had 653 families come through. So our numbers are staying right where we thought they would be in that 310 to 325 mark. And actually last month it was 322 and 331. So there is still a need here. Um, the people in the community have been so helpful and you, our volunteers, have been so great, um, be it those who come out or those who do things behind the scenes or those who just keep us in your hearts. We really appreciate all of your support and thank you very much. Um, anyone has any questions, you can always 
call myself or Susan or anyone on the board. We're happy to give you updates. And if you have any ideas for um, additional fundraising, we have a raffle coming out soon. But we are really um, hoping to get some more momentum and uh, make this, this Client Choice Pantry a reality for our community. Thank you guys and stay safe.